We did see a lot of sunshine once again today, but we also saw a high pollen count. And yeah, I told Kim during the sneezing. yeah I told Kim during the four. I'm going to try to get through this without sneezing. <laughs> <laughs> Sandia Peak, lots of sunshine through the afternoon hours, and we are starting to settle into the evening hours now, and the sun's starting to go down. Very nice evening in store with temperatures still on the mild side, at least before the sun is completely down, and we are on the mild side right now. 74 degrees is the current temperature in Albuquerque. A calm wind out there. We are looking at temperatures in the 60s over the northern mountains, 66 in Taos as well as Alamosa, 64 in Los Alamos. Down to the south, we are still rather warm here. We're in the 80s, 70s and 80s, 85 in Roswell, 88 in Carlsbad, and 84 currently in Hobbs. Winds, not as much of an issue today as they were yesterday, but we still had a few breezy locations. Las Vegas, one of the higher readings at 28 mile per hour winds, 16 miles per hour in Santa Fe as well as Grants, 21 mile per hour winds in Gallup, but we are seeing the winds start to go down. Down a bit, and they will continue to go down as we move into the evening hours. Taking a look at the setup, lots of sunshine around for today. A few clouds trying to creep into the southeastern part of the state, and they'll do a better job of doing so tomorrow. We're actually looking at a better chance of seeing a couple of spot showers in the far southeastern corner of the state, Eddy and Lee County. One of the couple of the areas that will have a better chance of seeing those showers. The rest of the state will stay rather dry, but we are watching this storm system, and this is actually going to throw a couple of pieces our way before the whole thing eventually passes to the north and will crank up the winds and cool us down. But between now and then, a clear and cool night on the way for the tonight, and then we watch for mostly sunny skies tomorrow. It will be on the warm side once again, and we will watch for the chance of at least a couple of spot showers in the far southeastern part of New Mexico through the afternoon hours. And then we watch a first piece of that system start to move through New Mexico. We're not looking for a big time precip. In fact, we're only looking for a few clouds with this first piece late Thursday and into Friday. It's when the system starts to pass to our north through Colorado that we really start to see big changes. And you'll see that in your zone by zone forecast. Starting in southern Colorado, where temperatures tomorrow topping out in the 60s to near 70 degrees with mostly sunny skies. We will stay on the mild side through at least the first half of the weekend, and then that storm system pulls through. We could get a couple of snow showers as far south as Durango. That will be the bottom edge of that storm system. So we'll keep that in the forecast for Sunday and Monday with higher winds and much cooler temperatures, only into the 50s for daytime highs. Over the northwest, temperatures here into the 70s with lots of sunshine. We stay mild here through Saturday, and then more wind, more clouds for Sunday and Monday, and cooler temperatures only topping out in the mid-50s for highs on Sunday and Monday. Day. Over the southwest, temperatures here in the 70s and 80s with lots of sunshine. The sunshine continues in Silver City through at least the next seven days with temperatures staying on the mild side in the low to mid 70s. One cooler day, that will be Monday with a high of 67. Over the southeast, temperatures here in the 70s and 80s with a few clouds around, especially in the afternoon. And we could pick up a couple of spot storms, especially as you move down toward Eddy and Lee County. More sunshine for Thursday, a few more clouds on Friday. Staying mild through the weekend, and then we cool down behind that system into the mid 70s on Monday and Tuesday. Over the Northeast, temperatures here topping out in the 70s and 80s with mostly sunny skies. We stay warm on Thursday with a high of 73. Then we start to cool things down with a few more clouds on Friday. Then we warm back up on Saturday before really cooling down with that system pulling to the north. We'll be back into the 50s by the time we reach Monday. Over the northern mountains, temperatures here will be anywhere from 59 in Red River all the way up to 76 in Española with lots of sunshine. We stay mild through the first half of the weekend and then cool down to the 50s for early next week with big time winds Sunday and Monday. East mountains, temperatures in the low to mid 70s with sunny skies, mid to upper 70s for the metro with mostly sunny skies here as well. And we stay relatively quiet through the end of the week and the first half of the weekend. Then that storm passes to our north. We're looking for winds to gust up to near 50 miles per hour for Sunday and Monday with temperatures cooling back to the upper 50s by Monday. Mm. That's not good. Yep. All right, thanks, John. Well, sports is next.